yes now, bless now. Don't forget the rest now, yo. It's been a long time coming, but I'm giving a little bit back to the Sabaton fans out there. Yo, you lot are wild. There's a bloody big team of you lot, so I want to say respect first and foremost. Now, get this microphone out of the way, it doesn't do anything. Uh, we're going to listen to the second LP by Sabaton entitled, uh, you correct me if I'm wrong, Etero Dominatus? Etero Dominatus? I don't know. But this is the title track, track 1 of 14. We're in for a ride, let's go, straight away. Come on. Etero. Come on. Dominatus. kick sounds massive already they must have had a decent sound engineer to be creating this sound right got the synths going mad in the background it wouldn't be it wouldn't be the same without the synth would it Come on. they're actually playing local uh what 14th of april yes yesterday uh 15th the OVO Arena Wembley, 15th of April, that's tomorrow. Tomorrow they're playing in London. That's crazy, where are they from? Sabaton, they're American band, are they? <laughs> nah, they're not, they're a European band, they're a European band. Six thousand tanks in our ranks. The Nazis must pay for the crimes. The wings of our eagles been broken. Marshals, two called soldiers, serve even in on the plate. Disregard the losses, the cities ask to take. Atero Dominatus. Atero Dominatus. Berlin is burning. Denique in table. moment i've lost a little bit of connection but yeah let me just say um it really is the sabaton way to have them big epic gang chants on the chorus section no band i think does it better than this band uh, it tends to definitely be the trademark we listened to the first album quite a bit back now and it felt like they were you know edging into that way sort of testing the waters a little bit as some of their songs didn't have them uh, style of vocals and when they weren't there it felt a lot emptier it felt like it wasn't Sabaton so yeah I, I, it wouldn't surprise me if we got a record full of that stuff from the get-go this time around yo
really cool solo. One thing the band does uh, is they write a really good song, and in doing so, they reel back the riffs. Because obviously they're very technical at what they are capable of doing, but, you know, during the riffs, during the rhythm section, you know what I mean? They can do more, add more to it, but they know they don't want to fluff it up too much because it's about the songwriting, it's about the structure of the song, and it's about the dynamic and getting that lyrical melody across in its most powerful sense, and not watering it all down. March. Fight! Die! In the ring! March! Fight! Conquer! Berlin! number great number really well formed really well put together um, whoever is structuring the songs is a genius knows exactly what to do we've got nuclear attack coming up next all right track number two hold on to your um you know your historical army set people let's go <laughs> <laughs> 